my Carolina Reaper has produced some early fruits. And you can guess why I made these little air quotes. Um, it doesn't really look like a reaper. The Carolina Reaper has this very pronounced stinger or tail and those um, just have a teeny tiny little knob at the end but no tail. And the plant that I took the seeds from uh, had these very pronounced uh, tails on the fruits. And I bought it at a plant market and it was labeled as a Carolina, Carolina Reaper. It looked like a Carolina Reaper so I guess either it wasn't pure or there was some uh, cross-pollination in my little, my own chili plantation. So might be an interesting hybrid perhaps. Or it's just the growing conditions for some reason that is lacking the tails now. But um, anyway, I will test one of these because um, I actually crossed this uh, individual into my Cariolo Kia Scorpion Strain D breeding line of chilies um, just to spice it all up and um, so I want to investigate if I did uh, choose the right plant to cross in to add a little bit a little bit of more aroma and of course more heat because of my Carolina Reaper Scorpion Strain D was a bit lacking in uh, these two departments. Yeah, so uh, without further ado, which one should I try? My original plan was to eat all three of them, but um, we shall see. Perhaps not. This one's looking... Ah, doesn't really matter. This one seems to be the oldest because the stem is already a little bit wilted. Uh, take the one with the most <coughs> most fresh steam. Mm -hmm. That's not okay. yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay, the smell is not very promising. Mostly I smell the green part, I guess. Okay. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> okay. No habanero taste. You know this soapy kind of peachy aroma, which I don't like. That's a plus. It's not that hot. I'm just being a little bit melodramatic with my facial expressions. And, well, sadly, not very fruity. I will 
Now press my tongue against the um, palette and see if my eyes tear up. That's a good a gold standard for heat for me. Well, barely, barely. Hmm. <clears throat> Reaper. Although it's hot enough that I do not have the desire to eat more, actually. Not really. But I will do. Same thing with the smell. <coughs> Okay, either it's the additive effect, or this one. <coughs> this one was hotter than the last one. Also juicier. <sighs> yeah, this one was hotter. You can feel it going down. I think. Well, that's uh, an interesting thing with the super hot chilies. Um, it's always just which one's the hottest, which one's the hottest. But um, for me, it's actually more interesting to look which one has the highest average heat. It's uh, a bit inconvenient if there are really super super duper super 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 duper 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 hots on the one plant and simple very hots and maybe some that are not very hot at all it's a bit like russian roulette and it's not uh, reproducible i guess <clears throat> there are times the charm Again, not very strong smell, and perhaps they were too long on the plant before harvesting. I will have the third one, yes. Sir. Interesting. This one uh, has a kind of a, of a bitter taste. And I think it's hotter than the first one, but slightly less hot than the last one. So it's kind of a mixed bag so far. I tried uh, f um, fruits from this plant already, I think. Watch this video if you like. Also, uh, or some moron I tried um, the original Carolina Reaper, the, where the um, seeds are derived from, for these uh, fruits that I'm eating now. And the plants that produce these fruits, you know what I mean. And um, yeah, I will have a cup of tea now. <sighs> Is that the dangerous combination? Gunpowder tea and hot chili peppers? I 
Yeah, okay. I was hoping for more suffering, but I'll eat my ice cream anyway. Mm -hmm. Tasty walnut ice cream. <clears throat> That's actually the reason why I'm eating chilies, to have an excuse to eat a whole bucket of ice cream. Mm. 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 A few moments later. Oh, it's in my belly now. And it's always much more worse for me in my stomach than in my mouth. I guess I have fewer heat receptors in my mouth than in my belly. Oh. I guess they still have a little bit of capsaicin and co. And so on. Oh. <coughs> Stupid body, who builds this? No ouchie there, but ouchie there. I guess it's not so bad that I have to throw up or anything. But yeah, okay. They still have some meat. And maybe not as aromatic as I was hoping. But we'll see how it ends up in the combination with the Cardiolochia scorpion strain D. And this is uh, going to form the Carolina <laughs> Cariolochia screeper, which uh, there are a few individuals growing right now, and we will see how they turn out. Yeah. <laughs>